What's up, everybody? This is Joquelyn Burnham, aka Jay Z, The Quiet Storm. And today I am going to show you guys how to purchase the Nobility Token using your Trust Wallet. So if you don't have it, go ahead and go to the App Store, download it, and get ready to take the next step. So, what is Nobility? It's a DeFi token that will revolutionize the esports landscape by organizing and providing tournaments with large prize pools and helping content creators earn even more from playing the games that they love. This is going to be huge, guys. So we are getting ready to go ahead and pull up our trust wallet and get started. So let's get ready to jump right in. Pull out your so guys, device. Once you come to your trust wallet, you're going to open it up. The first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and add the nobility token. So actually I have some, so mine is here, but to add the token, you're going to go ahead and go to a browser and you're going to type in nobilitytoken.com. That's going to take you directly to their website and you can copy the token address for the Nobility token. So click the copy button here, and then you're going to return to your trust wallet. Up in the top right-hand corner, guys, you see a circle and a line and a line in a circle. You're gonna click there, scroll all the way to the bottom. At the very, very bottom, you see add custom token. Please click that. You're going to change your network to smart chain. In the contract address, tap there and paste that token ID. The name of the token is going to be Nobility. The symbol is capital N, capital B, capital L, and your decimals are 18. I'm not going to save this because I have already added this token to my trust wallet. So I'm gonna click done here. You guys will click save. I am going to click cancel and cancel back out of this. Okay, so the next step that we need to do is purchase some BNB. That's the Binance coin. Guys, that's the second coin from the bottom with the yellow symbol with the, I guess the white, I don't know, diamond in the middle of it. So you're gonna purchase some BNB coin and what we're going to do after that purchase, we're going to swap it to the smart chain coin, which is the black circle with the yellow diamond in it. So to purchase BNB, you're gonna go ahead and click on BNB. And then you're going to click buy in the very, very top corner. Because I have some, I'm going to purchase $10 worth. The minimum purchase is 50. So I'm going to purchase $50 worth. And then I like to use the Simplex third-party provider for my checkout. And I'm going to select that and then I'm going to click next. So it's going to take me to a screen where I can check out. I can enter my card details. I've read the terms and conditions and I'm going to click pay now. So a verification code was sent to my email. I'm going to go ahead and get that. It's asking me to verify my identity. I've already done that. Not sure why it's asking me that again, but if it does, go ahead and do that. So guys, because I've already checked out and purchased some of this coin, I just kind of want to show you guys how to get it. So once you get your BNB, I'm going to back out of this. The next thing you want to do is swap that BNB out for smart chain. You're going to click on BNB. So I don't have any currently, but you guys just purchased some, so you will have some. What you're gonna do next is click more. Then you're gonna click swap to smart chain. It's going to ask you how much do you want to swap? So however much BNB you have, you can swap it for the smart chain and you just click the blue swap button. I've done this previously again, so I'm going to exit out of this. So now I actually have money in my smart chain. So I still have $3.38 left over here. So the next steps are to go to Pancake Swap and swap out smart chain, smart chain for the Nobility Coin. So you're gonna swipe up and go back to your browser. This time you're gonna go to pancakeswap.finance. 
The first thing it's going to ask you to do is connect a wallet. Although you're connecting to Trust Wallet, please click Wallet Connect first, then click Trust. It's going to say connecting. It may take a few minutes, and then it's going to ask you to confirm your connection. So at the bottom of this screen, click Connect. So now I can go back to my browser. My wallet has been connected. So I'm going to go right back to PancakeSwap, and now I'm going to click on Trade Now. So as you can see, the BNB coin is selected here. And I don't have any, but if I did, it would show me that show me how much I had. And then this currency that I want to swap it to is going to be the nobility token that I added before to my trust wallet. Okay. So sometimes if you can't click the max amount and get it into this from space, you can go to liquidity and then go back to swap and then select your two currency again. And now it should allow you to type in the numbers and do whatever it is that you need to do. Again, guys, this is just for training purposes. I do not have BNB coin to purchase any nobility with. I've already done this. Before you do your swap, please click on this settings button next to exchange you want to make sure that your slippage is 15%, at least 12 to 15%. I chose 15%. The default transaction speed standard was not allowing my transactions to go through. So I changed my speed to fast, okay? Once you edit these settings, you can exit out of this. And then once you put an amount in here, I actually have insufficient funds to make this trade, but you will see the swap button pop up and you will click it and then you'll click it again to confirm. Once your trade or your transaction goes through, it will refer you right back to your trust wallet to check the balance of your nobility token, okay? All right, guys, so that is a quick and easy way to purchase the Nobility Token. Look out for more videos. I'll definitely drop the links to everything that I talked about and some steps that you can follow in addition to watching this video. All right, thanks for watching.